Canada this weekend. Well, City Beats next with a feature on the Queen of the Stars, a TV astrologer who adds twinkle to the Zodiac. That's next on Newswatch. Well, the weekend's here, and City Beat gets you ready with a preview of the musical menu in Montreal. But first, a look at the star of the stars. Hi, I'm Sue Smith. In the 60s, everybody knew their zodiac sign. In fact, you probably wore yours around your neck, right? But in the business like 90s, horoscopes are just passe. Well, not necessarily. Montreal has its own queen of astrology. Linda Massarella has the story. Meet Jocelyn Savard, otherwise known as Jojo, the queen of stars. It's here at home that she consults the stars for her TV show. Can anybody do this? You have to have a... Oh, it takes years and years and years. And of course, it's, I went two and a half years in India. I've been studying in Europe. I've been studying in the United States. Uh, you learn. But everybody and every sign has a purpose. And everybody has an, a, a, an essence of existence. And I think the job of an astrologer, when you're working professionally, first of all, it's a scientific background. You have a whole map of a blueprint of your life. But it's you that works with it. Two things that bring out her spirituality are animals and her own paintings. There's all, you can see the difference where I'm going from material maybe uh, with an ideal contact with nature, but also here trying to go to the essence of things, mm -hmm. capture the vibration, because all we feel and all we do, this is my cat, that's Mozart. <laughs> so I have three cats here and I love, I think, you see animals are great for us, and animals, especially cats in my case, they protect the soul. And uh, see, this is a mother, and I have the little baby, one minute, here you are. So you have, oh. this is my cute little baby. I call her Jojo. You know By what? the way, the kitties are cancer. We so get your energy. I was stop. born with this. That's why I do what I do. I have so much energy and in, with years I have learned to control it and to laser it, okay? So I find that, uh, I know when I went to India, they told me I had a big, big aura like this. That means when people walk into my aura, they get some kind of a, like a healing process. I don't You're know. Like, I joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. But with a smile, right? Yeah. So you never get electrocuted. Products. Mm -hmm. Jocelyn appears both on French and English TV. Oh, and her makeup artist is a Scorpio. She always gives you food for thought to think about later. You mm -hmm. know, as you're going, I say, well, yeah, she had a point about this. So I take it very serious what she says. You don't base your life on every word, but she gives you a perspective, a vision that you might not have had on your own. Believe me, uh, maybe I look like a doll, but uh, uh, I'm, I'm not a dumb, a d a dumb not doll. doll. <laughs> <laughs> the Valley of the Stars. A happy birthday to you again, Leo Sweethearts. And come on air, we are giving the people a chance to forget about life, their problems, just to trip for five minutes, trip for half an hour, and have a fantasy. I want to be a fantasy maker. So everyone, remember, I love you, and I kiss you. Be good.